Scan charts help you to easily plan your projects, modify schedules, and visualize tasks. Here you can add task lists, tasks, and based on their start and end dates, view them in a timeline format. To add a new task, simply click on the Add option on the top left corner of your screen. Now I've already added a few task lists right here. Let's uh, expand one of them. And here, so these are the tasks from under this list. Now let's start by adding a few dates for these tasks. So I'm just going to select a few dates from right here. And let's select a date for this one as well. Now, as you can see, based on the start and end dates we select for the task, you can see them in a timeline view on the right side. You can also set up dependencies between these tasks by simply dragging and dropping them from one end to the other. Let's set up a few more dates and dependencies, so just give me one moment. And here. So let's set up a dependency between these two tasks and let's do it for these two as well. Right. So now once we have set up the dependencies, if in case one task is delayed by a few days, let's uh, delay this task forward. You can see that it will automatically adjust the dates for all the dependent tasks. Now to view a task in the task detail window, simply right click and select the view task option. Plus there are multiple task options available here. You can also apply different constraints to manage how the task dependencies will work. On top, you get multiple options to manage the view of your Gantt chart. For example, you can zoom into your Gantt chart, you can also zoom out of it. Project managers can also set up a baseline for the project from right here. So if I click on this option and click on yes. Now a baseline has been set up which means the actual or the current start and end dates of the tasks are recorded. Now if I click on this option, it will show me the current start and end dates and the actual start and end dates. Now for example, if this task is moved forward, now as you can see, it shows you the current and the actual start dates on this one single screen. Now clicking on the context menu on the top right corner of the screen will give you the option to collapse or expand your Gantt chart or download it in a PDF format. Do let us know if you have any questions or you have any feedback to share and we will be happy to help.